It seems that whenever a car company launches a small car in Canada, they choose Quebec City as the location. Why? Well, simply because Quebecers love small cars and sales figures prove it out, as Quebec owns 50% of the subcompact market. And so it is that Mitsubishi has chosen Quebec City for the North American launch of the 2014 Mirage. When I first started in this business, my boss said, Brad, it doesn't matter if the audience likes or dislikes you. If they don't know who you are, you're in trouble. Well, that about sums up the challenge with Mitsubishi. They sell about 20,000 cars annually, but this is their 10th anniversary in this company they need some loving. They want to see new faces in the showroom. And what Mitsubishi is hoping is that with the Mirage, its first foray into the subcompact market, they're hoping this will be the ticket. We are celebrating our 10th anniversary this year and we're very proud that we've been able to have the success that we've had in Canada. And now we're going into a whole new segment which is the subcompact segment. This is a segment that we've always wanted to be part of. It represents about 100,000 vehicle sales a, a year in the Canadian marketplace. And we're excited about it. We're bringing in the Mirage, a very affordable, very fuel efficient vehicle with a 10 year warranty. Should bring some new customers to the Mitsubishi brand, make more people aware of just how good our product is. This vehicle is relatively new. It's been on the road for approximately a year in other markets. Uh, the vehicle is produced in Thailand. It has a 1.2 liter three cylinder engine, 74 horsepower, 74 pound feet of torque. You'll also notice that the vehicle has a very small footprint. However, inside the vehicle, you got lots of leg room and it's got competitive uh, cargo space. It's good to have some punchy colors to, to really add some flair to the vehicle. When you get some of these more dramatic uh, colors, it can be a little bit of a gamble, uh, but uh, we believe with this segment, the, the bright appealing colors will, will definitely uh, uh, have uh, some interest and, and we will see some, some sales of these colors. It's always been a challenge as a new player into the marketplace. We've been here for 10 years, but when you look at most of our competitors, they've been here a lot longer than 10 years. And it takes time to build that, that recognition up with the Canadian consumer. So this product, yes, we believe it's going to bring in a whole bunch of new customers to the Mitsubishi brand. It's going to be a, a, a real awakening to people that you can actually buy a Japanese quality product that's going to be selling at 12498 into the marketplace with 64 miles to the gallon and a 10-year warranty. The new Mirage comes with either a five-speed manual or a CVT transmission. I know, I'm always complaining about them, especially in a four, or in this case, a three-banger, and I'm not the only one, but they're here to stay. And Mitsubishi says the CVT transmission in this car is the best one yet. The big difference with the Mirage CVT is that it utilizes this new auxiliary gearbox and essentially what that does is it doubles the ratio uh, for the transmission. And essentially an easy way of thinking about that is to imagine a bicycle where you have a select number of gears on the back wheel, say maybe seven gears, and then you have a gear at the front at the crank and that gives you the seven gears. In the case of our new CVT, it's like adding an additional gear at the front so it now doubles it to 14 gives you a lot more ratios, puts you in much better uh, position in terms of acceleration. Uh, it's, it's, it's optimizing the transmission and, and engine at the same time and allows for uh, better responsiveness and uh, excellent fuel economy. You know, when most people are shopping for a vehicle, they are under the assumption that bigger is safer, and there is some truth in that. However, as we all know, small cars undergo the same stringent crash testing. In fact, with the Mirage, it got a five-star rating in Australia. Lots of damage, as you can see in the front, but the compartment holding the human beings has not been compromised. And Mitsubishi is convinced it will get a five-star rating when it's tested here in North America. Mitsubishi is about to grow. Uh, you know, we've, we've come to the level where 20,000 vehicle sales, we want to grow our business to 25 to 30,000 vehicle sales. And this is a stepping stone for us. This product brings a whole new segment, a whole new different buyer to our, to our dealerships, and will bring us to the next level of sales.
a mirage give Mitsubishi the attention it wants so badly? Well, let me put it this way. A Mitsubishi executive said, what do you think of the car? And I said, it is what it is. It's as good as the competition. And what is it? Well, it's a small three-cylinder vehicle, 74 horsepower, great around town. And I might add, not all small cars have a good turning radius. This one does. And that's a plus. And it cruises nicely on the highway. And finally, what's not to like with a 10-year, 160,000-kilometer warranty. So yeah, it is what it is, but that's not a bad thing.